Okay, in this problem they want us to simplify this expression. Let's take a look. Uh, with this one, over here, there's nothing really we can do, so we're going to leave that alone for now. Let's take a look over here. We can use the distributive property to distribute this into this. Okay, so let's rewrite this statement over here without the parentheses. So we're going to have negative 2x to the square times x to the cube. Okay, this come, came from these two, and we're going to write this one down, plus 10x to the fifth, and this one stays the same, we didn't do nothing uh, to it. Now, we're going to take a look at these two over here. We're going to notice that we can use the rule of exponents, and therefore we're going to get negative 2, x on the 2 plus 3, when we are multiplying, we're going to add the exponents, so therefore we're going to get x on the power of 2 plus 3, and plus 10x to the 5. We still didn't do nothing with this one. So let's uh, write this in a nicer way. Negative 2x to the 2 plus 3 is 5, so x to the 5th, plus 10x to the 5. We still didn't do nothing with this one. And now we can see that we can combine like terms. We have an x to the 5 over here, we have an x to the 5 over here. We're going to go ahead and combine these two. Negative 2, 10, that's going to give us an 8. And we're going to have x, uh, 8 times x to the 5th. And there you go, this is our solution.